A very good morning to our honorable principal, sir, respected teachers, my fellow friends, everyone at present out there. My name is Subaita, roll number seven, and I'm from class five Boston. Katpirali, Katpirali, Tera tumi khao, Gur muri khao, Dud bhaat khao, Bata dilebu tao, Beral bacha kukur chana tao. We've all heard this poem in our childhood, but it's one of the best poems written for children. And today is the 123rd birthday of that poet, Kazi Nozrul Islam, the national poet of Bangladesh. In the evening of 24th May, 1899, a male child took his first breath after coming out of the womb of his mother, Zahid Khatun. He was born in the Trulia village of Bordaman district, West Bengal. He came into this world with the blessing of God and enlightened his family. He was born in a poor family, so he was nicknamed as Dukumia, sad man. His father, Kazi Fakir Ahmed, was an imam of a mosque and a caretaker of a local mosque. Nazrul received his basic education from a maktab, which was run by a mosque and then attended a madrasha run by a verga. Nazrul Islam lost his father at the age of 10. To support his family, young Nazrul started working as a new caretaker of the mosque where his father used to work. He then joined his uncle, Fazek Lips, traveling to way to the group. He used the opportunity to learn Latin. He also started writing songs and poetry for plays, which eventually invented to them the Sanskrit and Bengali literature. Later, he was admitted to two schools, but unfortunately, Nasrul could not pay for his studies, so he had to quit his education. Nasrul catapulted to fame with the publication of Beat Rohi in 1922, which remains his most famous work. And as such, he's called as the Beat Rohi Kobi Ribet Poet. Kazi Nasrul Islam is a source of our inspiration. He is a torchbearer of Bengali nation. Therefore, we should pay proper tribute to him. Thank you.